Perry County Sheriff's Office says staffing numbers are rising thanks to a new law that allowed states the option to lower the age requirement for correctional officers from 21 to 18. News 13's Jackie Labrizzi was at the detention center this afternoon where she spoke to an officer who has been impacted by this change. The new law went into effect in May of last year after correctional offices all over the state were dealing with staffing shortages. And deputies with the Horry County Sheriff's Office say this has been beneficial in keeping the detention center staffed. Since it's been in effect, we've hired, I think, 15 people under the age of 21. And it's been very successful. Sheriff Philip Thompson says they don't hire everyone who applies, but the selection process made up of interviews and tests is the same for everyone, no matter their age. He says one of his concerns was maturity, but says he's realized that's dependent on the individual, not age. Sheriff Thompson says this helps those not going to college right now and adds people can join the military at 18. And for now, 20 year old Chesney Higginbotham, this was all a part of her dream. I wanted to be in the profession where you could protect. Right? I mean, you know, you fight and protect your country in the military. You fight and protect your people here. Hagen Botham says after finding out about her medical disqualifier, she couldn't join the military, but after applying and getting this career opportunity has been an eye opener for her. It does mentally mature you and it does prepare you for your future in law enforcement. Sheriff Thompson adds correctional officers don't carry weapons and training has expanded since this law was put into effect. You have very close supervision. You're, you're in the same building, you're in the same housing units, and you have supervisors and experienced officers that have been there for periods of time readily accessible to you. Sheriff Thompson says this law allows people to have a head start in their career and says just because they start at the detention center doesn't mean they have to stay in corrections. Eventually, later on into law enforcement, I do want to go on the road and, you know, build up my career from them. Sheriff Thompson says the new law has been beneficial to boosting their staffing, but says another benefit with this career is that county council increased the starting salary for correctional officers about a year ago to $50,000 a year. Reporting in Conway, Jackie Labrizzi, News 13. And Sheriff Thompson says within the past couple of years, his office went from more than 50 vacancies to fewer than 20. And with the new recruiter position at the office, he hopes to add more officers in the near future.